we've come down here to the River X in the lovely part of Devon to meet our latest patron, Bob Mortimer. He's currently doing some filming work in the river uh, with his co-star Paul Whitehouse. We're hoping to catch up with him at lunchtime, so we're all set up and ready to roll. Well, it, I'm just so thrilled that you know you're joining us as our latest patron, and I'm really um, confident that with your su super sort of fan base, that we're going to introduce a lot more people to the pleasures of keeping chickens. Well, I hope so. I hope so too. Especially your chickens. Yeah, especially our chickens. They yeah. deserve it. They're hard-working girls, and yeah. they really deserve a nice, nice. Egg. They've kind of done their time, haven't they? They have. So, yeah. yeah. So free-range retirement is what we're looking for. So yeah, I'm, I'm thrilled to have you on board. Um, and as a small token of my appreciation for that, I have bought you a little something. Before I'm going to hand it over though, I have one Is question for you. Is it a chicken? No, no, it's not a chicken. But I do have one question for you, and that is, in your opinion, Bob, why did the chicken cross the road? Why did the chicken <laughs> cross the road? Um, <laughs> I think probably something to do with his feet. So I'm thinking to sort of get to the cobblers. <laughs> Get to the cobblers, okay? Maybe. That's an interesting one. Not definitive, okay. but put it in the pot. Put it in the pot, yeah. it could be. Have could a think be. about that one. Yeah. <laughs> That's brilliant. Okay, well, this is just a small... I love getting gifts, Jane. Okay, well, this is just a small reminder of your pole dark days, because you're down here in lovely southwest, yeah. and we thought it might sort of be a bit special for you. Here we go. They are some, IPA. There's some very special... Um, artisan Exmoor beers for you. Oh right, how and lovely. I, I'm not a beer drinker, but they were chosen especially by my local vintner, and there's two more over yonder for you. So, oh right, how you, lovely. They're all very different. And I think the person who chose them for me must know me a bit, because they're not too strong. Ah, okay. That's always my criteria. I did tell them that they were for you, so... I know I do go on a bit um, on Twitter and so on about my love of ordinary strength beer. It's right. all become very strong, Jane. Okay. They seem to be going to a race for to strength. Get to the strongest and beer. here is a vessel, I'm guessing. <laughs> it is. Thank you so much. You're welcome. That's made my day. Well. I wonder why you drink from pewter. Do you know the I answer don't know. to that? Maybe it was the four glass. I wonder if it kills know. bacteria or something. Thank you. And all the girls, by which you mean all the girls at the office, but actually all the girls with feathers on, because you'll... That's what I was thinking. You'll make a difference to a lot more hens, there's no doubt about that. Cheers. Get yourself a chicken. <laughs> you never know, you might get a tankard somewhere along the line. <laughs> no, you won't get any tankards. <laughs> no, you won't get Tank a tankard. Tankards don't come free with chickens. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you so much. Thank you so much. And now, of course, I'm tempted to start boozing, which I shouldn't <laughs> because we're in the middle it's of the middle of the day, in the middle of filming. <laughs> Thank you, Jane. Thank you so much.